Why have you done my hair like that? What do you mean? Well, look at it. Hello, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I did this to wind Lance up, but I've been growing a moustache this week. Lance absolutely hates it. Of course, I mean, so do I, but it's also kind of just fun to do it, because why not? Nobody's gonna see me. Oh, wait. This is on YouTube, and people can see it. So today, I'm getting Lance, my husband, to cut my hair, and probably get rid of this. Maybe, although I'm gonna try and persuade him to keep it. Anyway, I'm about to have my hair cut by Lance. Wish me luck. I have no idea what I'm doing. You've cut people's hair before though, yeah? Uh, I've used scissors. I've used clippers to cut hair. Never on the head though. Because I was a swimmer, so like, you know, you trim your hair. My mustache on this angle looks fabulous. Also, I don't care how it turns out because I don't know who this is. I don't know when it is that I married a 70s porn star. Welcome to the um, Hungry Jackal DLB hair salon. Tell us do it. My hair is like unbearably long, so let's So what do you do? What do we want? What do okay, you want? so I took a few pictures from, from uh, Google. I don't know if it's because I like their hairstyles or because I think they're cute, but we'll see. Wait, I asked you to find pictures of yourself. Like pictures of the hair you liked, and instead you went on a boy hunt. No, there's three options. Yeah, so here we go. This one, which is quite choppy. I like the choppy, messy style. And my hair's not quite as long as that though, so I don't know if that's gonna be possible. There's this one, which is like a black and white. Again, it's just longer on top, I just like trimming up the sides, tidying up. And then the last one is a little bit shorter, but still messy, but still a little bit like. So I'm scared that you're gonna like shave too much off the side to make me look silly. Hunt. So which boy do you want? Do you want boy number one, number two, number three, or do you want to show me a picture of you with a haircut you like? Because I am going to, as they say on the cooking shows, I'm gonna nail it. All right. Well, do you have like an apron or a bib or something for me, Tom? No, for me, not for you. Oh, wait. I need an apron. Well, because I don't want a hair on me. Apron. You don't need it. I want everyone to know that um, you just heard Tom Daly's, I call it the COVID wine. I don't want it in it. Let's be real about who's been doing the COVID whining most. Silly daddy, that's right, Robbie. Texas. I need a haircut, but I don't have a YouTube channel, so I don't have to do things like this. Really, really bad judgment. Cause I, I don't know what I'm doing. What? Are you mad at me? Of course I'm mad at you, you're about to cut my hair, so I'm preempting the madness. Well, why don't you chill? Do you want a drink? Of what? Do you want a little something? I no! Know. Lance, it's 10 a.m. I've got this. Put a guard on it. I'm gonna plug it in. There's a, there's a string, would you get the string, please? Okay, let's go. No! No! Just do that, you have to put a guard on it. I'm not letting you freehand it. Oh my god, I can't, you're about to just ruin everything. Wait, no! Get off! Stop, no, do it seriously, because I'm starting to panic now on whether this would uh, be a good idea. Of course it was a good idea. Are you sure you don't want a drink? I'm sure. You, you have to chill. I'm gonna start with this, like, a number seven. It's a way, seven? It's way too long. That's really long. I normally get, like, a two or a three, so. Oh my God. Go for it. There's a term that might apply. I don't know where it comes from, where it's derived from. I'm into language. The, uh, but it's called a bossy bottom. I don't know what that means, where that comes from, but I, I, I feel like you might be one of those right now. Oh, yeah! Oh! Ah! Eee! Should I be looking at your head while I do this? You're gonna, next week, I'm gonna cut your hair. Absolutely not. Just deciding where my efforts are going to end. Oh god. Whoa. Oh god. Did you watch any like YouTube tutorials or anything before? <laughs> yeah. Which one? Uh, I watched Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Uh, but the one that was really helpful was Bob Bob Black Sheep. 
there's option A of not having a haircut until this is all over, or option B, let your husband cut your hair and... I'm slightly concerned by the amount of hair that is on the floor right now. Well, I think you should actually be concerned about the amount of hair on your head. I'll tell you what I am concerned about. The fact that I show you three pictures and you've not referenced the picture once. That's because I'm jealous of those boys in those pictures. You made me jealous. I've had many bad haircuts throughout my life. Yeah. Mainly because I was always paranoid about the size of my ears, mm. the size of my nose, and the size of my forehead. So I always had my hair flattened to my forehead like this, and then spiky at the back from about eight or nine years old. And then when I was like somewhere around when I was like seven, a weird pressed down fringe with flat cut. When I was about 17, 18, I decided, you know what, I'm just going to embrace the big forehead and just like spike it up. And what a mistake that was. Get away, get away, get away. No, don't you dare. There's an eyebrow above your lip. Stop. No, don't. Don't. Can I give you one of those things where I do a chip out of your eyebrow? No, absolutely not. Oh, that tickles. Oh. Oh. <laughs> mm. Do they do that to you at the salon? What, blow me? Yeah. Do you get blown by your hairdresser? What are you doing? You just have a few of these all yeah, around. Don't do that because they grow back. You've got a ball patch on the back of your head. So. No, I do not. Do I have a bald spot on the back of my head? Do I have a bald spot? <laughs> It's not a bald spot. It's just where all the hair meets. You have two of them. Are you serious? No, you don't really. All right, do you want me to cut the top? A little bit, I guess. Maybe take a little bit off some fringe because it's like getting in my eyes, you know what I mean? How do they do that thing where there's the, they have the scissors and the comb going? Look at what you're doing. Now at the salon that I uh, go to, it's not really a salon, it's a barber shop, they, um, and I'm going to try this on Tom, they take, um, for like ear hairs and stuff, they take fire and they put the fire into the ear. So I have a, I have a lighter, um, and I'm just going to put it into his ear, hold on. Just gonna, I'm just gonna get little hairs out of his ears, all right? You're just you kinda... are not going anywhere near me with that. No way. Here, I'll do it to myself. Ready? Here we go, you do this, and then quickly get it near the ear. <laughs> if you still feel like you should stop, you should probably stop. Uh, 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 hey. Oh God. Fair play, you've actually done all right, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. I never like it when it looks too freshly cut. What is under your nose? <laughs> Why do you have an eyebrow under your nose? Mm. So do you like it? Yeah, I like it. I, do we need product in it? Is that what we're saying? Do you need to style it? <sighs> All right, I brought some things, some products up. Excellent. Okay. Uh, there's another one that you always have. It's in the jar. There's this hairspray. That is the ocean. Should we see if it gives it texture? No, absolutely not. Because you were so good and well behaved. Yeah, your haircut. How many people blow jump? Ow. This is good. <laughs> what? This is good. I've dedicated so much emotion. I've dedicated so much of my life to like telling stories and films and political work and when what I really could have been doing was hair. Yeah, I'm not having that. Wait, hold on, hold on, I'll fix it, I'll fix it, I'll fix it. No way. No! You yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to reveal the combination of A, B, and C, as you recall on the left of your screen. And now on the right, a slow turnaround from Thomas Daly. Nailed it! Nailed it! Why have you done my hair like that? What do you mean? Oh, look at it. Well, I'm gonna go fix this and come back. Cock-a-doodle-doo!
I, I genuinely don't, I don't know what his problem was. I feel like that was one of the better, that was one of the better haircuts he's ever had in his entire life. I styled it really, really nice, and now you're gonna restyle it? You sure you don't want me to do it? I'm sure. D, the big reveal, D, 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 the big reveal, bring it! Cover girl, put the bass in your walk, head to toe. Oh my god, it's pretty good. I don't know, come on. Done As okay. COVID cuts go, he's done okay. You still love me on the other side of a COVID cut? What do I get for it? Oh yeah, baby! Anyway, so obviously Lance has finished cutting my hair. My battery's about to die. Oh, don't look at my um, hair. But I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. I'm gonna cut yours next week. Hey! No, no, no. no. Okay, bye.